the Duke Blue Devils and the UN Running Rebels. Now let's meet the starting lineups. For Duke at forward, a 6'5 senior from Fayetteville, North Carolina, number 21, Robert Bricky. For UNLV at forward, a 6'8 junior from Pasadena, California, number 32, Stacy Ogman. For Duke at forward, a 6'11 sophomore from Angola, New York, number 32, Christian Leitner. For UNLV at forward, a 6'7 junior from Dallas, Texas, number 4, Larry Johnson. For Duke at center, a 6'10 senior from Bloomfield, New Jersey, number 30, Ala Abdul Nabi. For UNLV at center, a 6'10 senior from Washington, D.C., number 00, David Butler. For Duke at guard, a 6'4 senior from University Park, Illinois, number 3, Phil Henderson. For UNLV at guard, a 6'1 and a half sophomore from Detroit, Michigan, number 12, Anderson Hunt. For Duke at guard, a 6'0 freshman from Jersey City, New Jersey, number 11, Bobby Hurley. For UNLV at guard, a 6'2 junior from Las Vegas, Nevada, number 50, Greg Anthony. And introducing the head coaches, for Duke in his 10th season, Mike Krzyzewski. For UNLV in his 17th season, Jerry Tarkanian. The double O. Henderson with a lot of time, misfiring. Johnson off with the rebound. Lead now to Ogman in a foot race with Kubek. Hurley's back in, going inside him, and a blocking foul down low. Hurley able to swing in one after Nabi and Johnson read it. Now into the hands of Hunt. Two on one. Great job by Hunt, and he also is a finisher with a dunk. A Steal by Ogman. Henderson's back. He's special. Well, you know, the towel all started way back when Tark used to get a dry mouth, and he didn't like to drink water because the cups always fell on the floor and spilled out. So. Line. That's his first field goal there of the game. There goes Stacy. There's that high lob. Duke was hoping to prevent it. There it is. Ah! Ah! Leitner taps it into the hands of Vegas, and Anthony make the long throw but instead he hands it off quickly to Anthony who brings it up time for Anthony oh, and, he hits it. and we have come to the end of the first half Butler whips it back to the top and there is Johnson oh, and that's what he did on Saturday he hit a three against Georgia Tech in the first half and now it is 50 35 from the left baseline Henderson now watching from the sideline and here's Hunt alone coming in on Leitner and it'll fall It'll be Johnson with his second three-point attempt, and he's perfect. He's it all. Another turnover. Ogman forces the pace. Finds Hunt on the break. Beautiful. Timeout, Duke. And Brett, they're really getting confidence now. There it is again. Another steal. It was Ogman. Hunt right down the middle for the layup. Whoops to Leitner from Hurley. Misses, and that's an indication of how this game has gone. At the other end, it is Hunt bringing it into the pass. Ogman, and it's all the running revs. They feel it now, and Krzyzewski will use another timeout. Down in low. Coming through two, Great and the defense was there again. And now it's into the hands of Butler. Everybody runs the floor right now. Hurley squeezes through. What a rebound. Big man. Larry Johnson off with the rebound, 72-47. Hunt hits a three, and folks, this one's all Vegas. Now, Tarkanian was ordered suspended for two years by the NCAA, and that suit went all the way to the Supreme Court. Super Bowl this year was a route won by the San Francisco 49ers. Jones puts one in, and now the running Reds are going to wrap this one up in easy fashion. The World Series was one-sided last year, won by the Oakland A's. And you know, Brent, this will be the first team from the Pacific time zone that has won a final championship since UCLA way back in 1975. You've covered a million sporting events. Have you ever seen one where a team at this level has dominated in every facet of the game? Yeah, record-setting night, 103-73, UNLV.